All right, guys, welcome back. It's Tuesday, second Monday of the week, as I like to call it. And we're gonna focus on that midsection, getting ready for spring, ultimately getting ready for summer as we're quarantined at home. So we're gonna go through three rounds of this circuit for quality. First up, we are going to do 40 hollow rocks. Then we are going to do 30 V-ups. Then we're going to do 20 leg lifts. Then 10 sit-ups. Not too many options for my folks who have weights, but I will still kind of show you something to get you rolling. Once we complete a round, we're going to rest for two minutes before we go into the next. So first on the list is our hollow rock. I always tell everybody this is your best banana impersonation because as we come to the floor, we're trying to have no angles throughout the entire body. And what that looks like is I'm going to lay down on the floor. Hands are gonna come covering my ears. Feet are straight. Shoulders come off the ground. Feet come up. And it's a very gentle rocking motion. So if that's too difficult, we can just bring one knee in. And that'll take a little bit of stress off the core. Exercise one, hollow rock. We're doing 40. Exercise two is the V-up. So we're testing your alphabet skills here. You're going to bring your lower and upper half together to create um, the letter V as the name suggests. So we're gonna come to the floor. Similar motion to that hollow rock where arms and legs are gonna start off the ground. You're going to come up at one point and then come back down. Try and keep your legs as straight as you can, but some of us have tighter hamstrings and that's not gonna allow for it, but do your best. We're doing 30 V-ups. Our next exercise is going to be 20 leg lifts, which is almost like half of that V-up that we had just done. So a lot of times I see folks put their hands on the sides of their butt for extra support. I think that's most comfortable for all of us. So legs are gonna start straight. I'm going to lift over my hips, come back down. And the important part is my feet don't touch the floor. I'm trying to keep those abs engaged the whole time. And that's our leg lift. Last but not least, we're gonna get into the sit-up, which we did yesterday if you were checking in. If not, go back to yesterday and check that out. But the sit-up, we can do either with our feet flat or with the soles of our feet together, which is gonna be more targeting um, the abs. So, hands are going to touch behind our head. Big judo chop, touch in front of our feet. If you have a dumbbell or something heavy, we can do a weighted sit-up to where I have two options. This one looks harder, but it's actually easier. Dumbbell comes overhead, I'm going to sit up. Head comes through my arms at the top. If you want an extra challenge, you can bring the dumbbell to your chest, kind of hug it. Oh yeah. Then you will do the sit up there. That's our weighted option. So when I complete a round, I'm going to rest for two minutes. Then I'll get back at it for that next one. 40 hollow rocks, 30 V-ups, 20 leg lifts, 10 sit ups, either with or without weight. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next one. Send to a friend if you want them to have washboard abs. Like, subscribe, comment. See you guys tomorrow for our next quarantine fit.